Hey gamers, I'm back. Time to go back to Radio Kaikan. All the way to the building. All right. Just checking, double checking. No, Kat is already good. Welcome back. The Mahinen analysis is finished and I just woke up. We've gathered enough data on the Mahinen to create an ARC program for Ms. Raikkonen. The Mahinen's energy readings were even greater than I expected. We need a little more time to process the data. You've been constrained for quite some time, Ms. Raikkonen. If you'd like to get some fresh air, I think we can allow a brief excursion. Xenia will keep watch here. Right. I don't mind looking after the place for a little while. He probably has some errands to run, too, so go stretch your legs. You heard him. Well then, shall we go? <laughs> it's the same ship again, let's go. Always saying the quiet part loud. I'm giving you an opportunity, so get out there and enjoy your time together. <laughs> Thank you for looking out for us. It's not like that. It's, well, look, he did his part by fighting, and you did yours by providing a sample. Come on. Xenia's giving us plenty of reasons, so let's just take him up on his offer. Finally getting the Kati part of the Kati route. Is there somewhere you wanted to go? I'll walk anywhere in Akihabara with you. This town is filled with precious memories. What's this? You're not being serious, right? I mean, if you were, I would knock you into next week. It's the funny answer, so I picked it. Well, if you really don't have anywhere in mind, then we'll go to Main Street. Let's move out. And fight Pops in the gang. The first time I arrived in Akihabara, this view left me breathless. It was as if all my dreams were coming true before my eyes. You can travel the whole world and never find a town that loves anime and manga like Akihabara. It's the envy of the world. It's the epicenter of otaku culture. This street has such an overwhelming atmosphere. The sidewalk is lined with specialist shops. Even just passing by them makes me feel like an Akiba master. Speaking of which, do you remember? After I joined the Freedom Fighters and went to Sanvo for the first time, I got so confused by the menu. You stepped in and ordered for me. I'll never forget the first bite of that beef bowl. At that moment, I knew I belonged here. Beef Ball OP. But this is my favorite spot. The view here is just perfect. After all, this is where we first met. Wait. Where is this? Feels like this is a new place. What the fuck? How do you hide the window? Forgot. There we go. Feel like this is new. I haven't been here at all. I came here on study abroad because I was drawn to Akihabara. But when I actually arrived here without any clue, you were the first person who spoke to me. You showed me many, many wonderful places. Your favorite anime stores, the specialty shops hidden away on Junk Street, the cafe and curry restaurant on the side streets. From the moment I met you, my life in Akihabara began. A life with you, Toko, the Freedom Fighters. What if we could go back? Even if I lost everything, even if I died, I don't want you to have to give anything up. I don't want you to betray your friends or Akihabara. I'd miss everyone's smiling faces. 
There's no going back. Oh, I love you. I love you so much that I can't help it. So the thought of you suffering for my sake is just too much to bear. Hey, yo, MC. Haven't seen you in a while. What's up? What's up? Anyway, nice CG. Let's go. Joy. I don't know what to do. I wanted to stay with you, so I agreed to leave the Freedom Fighters. With each passing hour, with each moment we spend together, my heart wavers. <laughs> You're kind and wonderful, so much that my heart hurts. The time we spend together should be happy, yet I can't enjoy it. I've never felt this way. I don't know what to do. Yeah. Oh, hey, MC Dialogue. <laughs> Your kiss is so gentle. We talk big, but your ears are bright red. But that's exactly what I like about you. What I love about you. So, please, please cherish this memory forever. The warmth of your hand and mine. Okay, I'm feeling a little awkward now. Shall we head back to the Radio Kaikon building? Can I go to this place? It's on the rooftop, right? Stop lying to yourself, Shizuku. You know as well as I that we can never understand humans. That is our destiny as Night Eaters. Stop, Soga. Yes, I believe you're right. I had hoped that he would grant my wish, but I was mistaken. It's not too late. Join me and we'll make our dreams a reality here in Akihabara. To survive, we have no other choice. I'll be by your side. Yeah. Oh. What? Ah, oh, hell, now let me up. I don't know. Oh yeah, I have a new CG. I will use it. Yeah, double checking. Please move up. Sup. Look who's back! You were supposed to get some air, but if anything, you look worse than before. Uh. Hey now, you're not going to impress anybody with such an obvious lie. What are you saying? We should keep that between us. Hey, yo, keep quiet. Excuse me for butting in, but we've just finished analyzing the Makinen data. The program for Ms. Makinen is ready. All that's left now is to capture the arc from Soga and extract the data, install this program, and remove the Makinen's power from Ms. Makinen. Hmm. Listing it out like that, I see what a monumental task this will really be. <laughs> At long last, my fists are aching and my heart's pounding. Time to get this party started. 
Yes. While I admire your enthusiasm, the Ark is a delicate piece of equipment. You must try to keep your brawl away from it, lest you damage it. And in any case, the Ark is not something that can be moved. This is a very complicated operation, as you can see. Right. So we need to draw Soga out again and distract him while you're working on the machine. No problem. We've mastered the unison strip. So if it's two on one against Soga, we don't need to stall him. We'll just knock him out. Now listen up, because this is very important. If the Ark stops or is damaged while the Mahinen soul is being removed from Ms. Reitman, I cannot guarantee her survival. Hey, sorry, bro. They fucked it up. I believe in you. So just be careful out there. And remember, dying is not an option. I won't allow it. Huh. A real otaku would say something about 2D supremacy right now. But I'm not feeling it. How strange. Counting on Saaguchi. Well, okay, then. Don't worry. Just leave it to me. Let's all do our part to make this operation a success. All right, here we go. I'm counting on your partner. This is the Zenya look. It's not even fucking close. Yeah. No more side mission. I might as well save it. I haven't fought anything with Kati on with Kati as my party member. Weird. No. I, no. I, I hate you, you fucking asshole. Hey, Sogo, what up? Pops, it's time. What's all this? Oh, fancy seeing you here. Is what I was thinking of saying. But now that we're face to face, Soga, I'm here for revenge. We borrowed a few components from your precious Ark. Without these, it's nothing more than a pile of junk. So not only do you know about the Ark, you know enough to get in my way. And here I was hoping you'd stay out of this, and I could spare your lives. That's exactly the arrogant bullshit that I'm sick and tired of. If you're looking for a fight, come and get it. Let's get the hell out of here. Stop. There's no escape. Run! I'm faster than you, bitch. <laughs> Shit. Looks like we really pissed them off. Yeah, you're a fucking dumbass. There's no use running. Yeah, I can't believe he caught up so quickly. He's faster than any synthester. I'll be honest with you, Xenia. You've surprised me. I didn't think you had it in you. What's that supposed to mean? He doesn't, by the way. He sucks. Oh, nothing complicated. You're immature. And you're foolish. Why else do you think I brought you on? I thought you'd be an easy, loose end to cut. I even accounted for the possibility that you'd be used up before my plans came to fruition. And that's what happened. <laughs> yeah, that's right. If I'd lost all those times to anybody but this guy, I just might have. But fighting him was different. Losing to him again and again, something changed in me. Or I guess you could say I remembered. I remembered what it meant to be an otaku. Absurd. Something like that's not enough to change who you are. I'm glad we could have this chat. I'm about to show you just how far I've come. I love Akihabara, and you'll see what an otaku like me is capable of. You're in the best. Hey, you. <laughs> I'm along with that. Yeah, I'm bored enough. Okay. Oh, 
on he's on the bottom. Of What the fuck? What the hell? I wasted my items for this shit. God damn it. Mm. <laughs> Not bad. But this is as far as you go. Let me go! Bye, Zenya. Your training hasn't been for nothing. I'll give you that. Perhaps you really have changed, but you're still nothing more than a synthesizer that I created. I'll make sure you regret your insolence toward your master. Hiro Taku's spirit is no match for my mind control. When I'm done, you'll be incapable of free thought or action. An empty synthesizer. An empty synth store. You're a real bastard, huh? Hey, same to you, you fuck. I can't. So you've accepted your fate. Now become the puppet you were meant to be. I, I'm an otaku. I draw spirit energy from otaku culture itself. I love it, and it loves me. I won't surrender in front of my beloved right. No, my beloved friend. So this is your otaku spirit. How impressive. But sadly for you, I've had a glimpse of your memories just now. That was a clever lie about your little theft from the Ark. And to think I let you trick me into leaving the Ark unattended. The charade ends here. Soka, wait! Oh, this is all my fault. Can you forgive me? As expected? Oh, it's like that. Look, I get that. But you don't need to say it to my face. Uh, this is no time to get depressed. Let's go! We can get to the Ark through the back door of the Radio Kaikon building. It's Soga's hideout, so keep your guard up. Bro, I wasted my fucking item for the shit. I'm stupid as fuck. I mean, this might as well be the same. I keep saying that. Fuck. I should stop. Okay. <laughs> Did it. What's up? Nobody's here. Sakaguchi, what are you doing here? <laughs> Soga, why are you here? I took the liberty of reading Zenya's memories and discovered his interest in the Ark. And if you have Kati here, then you must be after the Mahinen. You won't take another step! Unlike my female colleagues, this young lady has never treated me with anything but kindness. And more than that, 
She trusted me with her life. Oh, Gucci, being a good person. <laughs> I have a responsibility to save her. As a man of medicine, I took an oath. You're just a weak, whimpering human. You know you're no match for me. I'm a weak, greedy human. A slave to my own desires. Compared to a divine being such as yourself, I'm nothing more than an ant. But even an ant can fight back. How truly pathetic. Rip. Ah, Miserakinen, forgive me. Stop! That's as far as you go! <laughs> oh, I want to I wanna do it, but... Yeah, fuck it. What is this? You really think that'll buy you any time right now? No, I did it for the funny. I see. The Mahinen extraction is nearly complete. But there's already more than enough energy in the Ark for our purposes. This human's life is a small price to pay. Stop. Soga, wait. I need a moment. Let's settle this here. I don't want either of us to live with any regrets. I mean, why do we have to fight? I mean, I understand because my MC's ass, but. Is this really the time? You're the worst. I've been. I've been <laughs> doing this shit for the whole route, though. Lama. You made your choice. I only hoped that you would stay by my side, that you would grant my wish. Soga, this one's betrayal has opened my eyes. I see now why you value Night Eaters over humanity. As you say, we cannot coexist. What the fuck? That's a leap in logic, but okay. What? So, you finally understand. If you're prepared to fight on my behalf, then I will do the same for you. Even if you didn't do this shit, what the fuck? That's it then. Looks like Shizuku has made up her mind. I don't think there's anything you can say to stop this fight now. <laughs> I can't stop shaking. It's funny, right? To be honest, I'm still terrified of Soga. But if I can't face him, I'll always be the same weakling. Huh, it's strange. To think someone I loathe so much could give me such courage. All right, let's win this battle, save the princess, and get the best ending. It's time for some real heroics. Gucci, get up. I need you for the ship. I'm gonna do it again. The wrong one. Wait, some garbage. Wait, yeah, you're dead. Dun, dun, dun. 
Ah, oh, god. I wasted my fucking time doing that shit. Sitting there, right? Yeah. Uh, they do it. They do it. Fuck it. Wait, who have you? What? Fuck. Is it la the frame? Oh fuck. I'm dead. Rest in pieces. It's what happens when I decide to be funny. Wonderful. Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Sakaguchi. You really didn't come from shit. What the fuck is that? No, she's actually just sitting. I'm blind. I'm blind as fuck. I see. The Mahinam extraction is near. But the same as shit. I have my reasons. You made your choice. Yeah, reasons. And you're not? If you feel good cracking jokes at a time like this, I guess I'll just have to borrow some of that confidence. All right, let's win this battle. Maybe if you were something useful, we we'll need to fucking die a than the funny bastard. Help me, 
bastard. Job Zenya actually did something. All we wanted was to save Kati and restore peace to Akihabara. We don't want to destroy you or the Night Eaters. Give me back my shirt, you fucking assholes. Looks like the procedure is complete. With that, everything's finally over. We've won. It's gonna go explode. What should I do? Hate. I hate humans. Kill. Kill them all. What the? What's happening to her? She's possessed by something. This power. It's similar to a night eater, but... No. <laughs> what in the fuck? Free at last. What a feeling. After an eternity in darkness, I have returned to this world. This pitiful world filled with loathsome humans. Well, well. All the energy you stole from me is safely sealed within this ark. If I were to release it, I wonder just what would happen. Wait! My return calls for a celebration. For the fireworks, erasing this town should do nicely. And that will take care of all the pesky attachments lingering in this vessel. Otaku, keep your hand up, Akihabara. Uh, uh, may the force be with you. I mean, good job, Kati, I guess. What a 
nuisance. But it's only a matter of time before the energy in the Ark bursts. Until then, I might as well enjoy myself with a little bloodshed. Bye. I'm going out like this. I just wanted to save Akihabara together. Such kind words. We'll settle the score next time we meet. Not like you're gonna die anyway, you fucking bastard. She took him out with a single blow. His regenerative powers were no match. The legendary Mahinan. The ancient existence that resided within Kati. Now you've seen its true power. But why is this happening? The extraction was incomplete. The Mahinan's hatred remained within Kati and swallowed her whole body and spirit. So much of its energy is sealed in the Ark. Still a god amongst us. Among us. We cannot stop the Ark from exploding. We cannot stop the Mahinan's rampage. We've lost. A good leader should never give up so easily. Soga, was it? My name is Xi'an Kasugai. I'm the former CEO of Daishihan Pharmaceuticals. I assume you heard about me from Sakaguchi? Yes. I've heard of you, but why are you here? I followed Sakaguchi's trail. I've already made an assessment of the situation based on his plans and all this. Our first order of business is to keep the Ark from exploding. But the Ark has been damaged beyond repair. It cannot be stopped. Well, we won't know until we try, will we? I know you like being the lone wolf, but let's see if we can figure something out together. Yes. Yes, that's right. That's exactly right. Xion, will you help me? Gladly. I'm looking forward to working with you, Mr. Night Eater. Right. The pleasure's mine. Hey, this whole situation, the failure to fully extract the Mahinen, Sakaguchi's sloppy programming is to blame. Rip Gucci. If only he'd talked to me about it, we might have been able to avoid this, but... Well, there's no use crying over spilt milk. The Mahinan's energy has completely shrouded Kati's body, almost like a suit of armor. You should know what to do. Like I said before, I find you very curious. But I can see that that's not going to happen. Come on. I'm not used to spilling my guts like this, so let's just leave it at that. These might be our final moments together, so just accept my help. If we make it out of this, I won't get between you and Kati. I'm coming with you. I want to help too. Got the best party member in the group, let's go. If this really is the last time we see each other... I want you to remember how I look right at this moment, okay? Ah, shit. I'm not gonna get my t-shirt back. Is this really Akihabara? We have to stop Kati as soon as possible. No, I still can. What in the fuck? Hey, bastards! Still doing average compared to Soga in the game.
go to the safest place in town. Gotta believe. <laughs> I mean, it's true. You can punch me in the face for that shit. It's not your guy's fault, don't worry. Admissions. Well, that's why not, but let's go. First. I'm gonna go, go get my t-shirt What's up gamers? What's up bro? You're still here Finally got my best party member with nine 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 nine. Let's go. The only people that are our sinisters. Tayo, the Shadow Soul Hunter. Everybody's dead. Yeah, fuck. Yeah, whatever. Brother. Harrison Ford's. The hell?
Bruh, fucking shit. Ah, whatever. Hundred man, holy shit. Yeah, I wanna check this out. Probably gonna be the biggest waste of my time, but you know what? Really? You're the best partner for me, so let's check it out. Oh my god, that is so OP, it's not even coming close. Oh, 
so fucking good. Yeah, I just upgraded her fucking thing. I see that he's fucking dead. <laughs> Fix your job, Shizoku. So fucking gross. They're dying. What the fuck? How many fucking fuckers do I even? How many people did I kill now? What? yourself Let's 
fix yourself, you fucking bastard. I don't have my fucking bait anymore. God damn it. And now I'm getting to get fucked so much. She's always been fix herself. Hate it here. And this frames his fucking ass. Shizuku died the fucking wrong worst time ever. These frames are still ass. You know what? Fuck it, I'm ending this part here. Next part, I'm gonna try this shit again. I'm gonna need to fix the frames, I don't know why it's that way, but you know, fuck. Bye!